Hi students, MCQ number 7. A person standing between two parallel hills fires a gun and hears the first echo after t1 second and the second echo after t2 second. The distance between the two hills is to be determined. It is a very very interesting question. Now imagine this is uh, the person who is standing between two hills. So when he sh shoots uh, or fires the gun, uh, two echoes are heard. One sound uh, is uh, due to the echo formed by the left side hill. So the sound travels a distance D1 from him up to the hill. Then again it returns the same distance D1 to reach the person. So, what is the distance travelled by the sound on hill number 1? So, D1 plus D1 is 2D1. How much time it has taken is T1. Similarly, another sound which is travelling towards the hill number 2. It travels a distance D2 and it returns the same distance D2 okay, to reach him. This takes a time t2 now what is the clue here is the velocity of a sound in both the directions remains the same is it not the velocity of sound is the same so on the left side the velocity v is equal to the distance total distance traveled is 2 d1 divided by t1 is it not that d1 plus d1 that is 2 d1 distance is traveled in a time t1 so 2 d1 divided by t1 must be equal to the velocity of sound. So from this uh, v into t1 is equal to 2 d1 or the distance d1 is equal to v into t1 divided by 2. So this is the distance of uh, the first hill from the person. Similarly, for the second hill, if I write another equation, the velocity is equal to distance travelled is d2 plus d2, that is 2d2, divided by the time taken is t2. So, v into t2 is equal to 2d2, or the distance d2 is equal to what? v into t2 divided by 2. Now what is asked here, the distance between the two hills, that must be equal to what, D1 plus D2. Therefore, D1 plus D2 is equal to Vt1 by 2 plus Vt2 divided by 2. So this is equal to V by 2 into T1 plus T2. Therefore, distance between the two hills is equal to v by 2 into t1 plus t2 so option d is v by 2 into t1 plus t2 that is the right option okay therefore uh, option d is uh, the correct answer i hope you must have understood the fine